I'm doing it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. See, Steve, this is why we don't let him do anything with the candy. <laughs> Everything's falling apart, Steve. Oh, no. Craig's gonna do with the corn syrup. Just great. <laughs> I don't know why I just dried my hands off since I have to stick it in that yeah. water. I can see the uh, overwhelming confidence you have. It's gonna be good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's uh, 24 plus 7 is what? 24 plus 7, 31. Okay, you can put it on 31 here, okay? I think that's 31. Yep. 31? Is it? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know how to use this. Uh, no. Okay. Wait, wasn't it? Yeah, I think it was. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, he's testing it. you. Alright. Hey, okay, I'll show you one time how to do it, okay? okay. So you take your hands and get them nice and wet. Mm -hmm. Then you're just going to scoop a little bit, go back and forth. Put it okay. in there. Okay. Is this right. the one from yesterday or is this a new bucket? It's a new bucket. I was gonna say because Brian did really good with the corn syrup yesterday. Yeah. He was like, so this is what it's like when it's a good bucket? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, it's nice. It was drooping through my don't, hands. More you don't have to thought. try to get so much though. Just get oh, a small okay. amount. Smaller it's amount. easier. It's okay. easier to handle them. Yeah, like that. Yeah, okay. Get it going back and forth. Okay. <laughs> well, you gotta get more control of it and then throw it in. That's I like the first time I did it. It was like seeping through my hands so much. I was like, whoa. Well, you but yeah, but you had more. It you looked like you hands. had it more solidified together. Go ahead. Go back and forth to your hands. Okay, back and forth. Okay, now now once you got it going, then, then put it right in the bucket. I mean, uh, yeah. Yeah. The copper kettle. Copper kettle. There. It needs just a little more, so you don't okay. have to get much. A little baby scoop. Okay. That's good. And I got so much on my fingertips. Yeah, there you go. And I'll just put it in there. And then now take your hands and touch the corn syrup, and that will pull off the uh, corn Oh, syrup I've always seen your, you guys doing that. On your hands, and it pulls it off. Okay. You're going to add 14 sugar on top of that, so it's 31 plus 14. Uh, 45? Yep. Oh, good, there's a 45 right there. On the scale. Amazing. Can so I just pour it in? Then, yep. Go right. Looks like you have enough. Don't hurt yourself. All that sugar. That's Look at this style. How, wow. how do I know? Look at the scale. I know, up, I know, but it's when like... When that goes up, okay. then you got enough. When it goes up, halfway stop. Okay, halfway, okay. That's what I was looking for. So I was like, I don't know how much it has to go up. Oh. A little more. All right, I might as well just empty the bag. Yeah, I might as well. Yeah, this, this bag's going to be extra sweet. Spoon full of sugar. <laughs> <laughs> bag full of sugar. How <laughs> candy go down? <laughs> Two. One, two, half. Yep. That's how numbers go. That's how it goes, you know. Doesn't seem as smoky as yesterday. Well, the raspberry? Or yeah. no, maybe what, what flavor was that? We were doing spices yesterday. Yeah, spicy but flavors are pretty uh, smoky. Come on, get your hands dirty. Oh, should I wear gloves? Yes. It's very hot. I should have said no, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but these Just are all lefties. Well, there's a left pile and a right pile. It's about time you got in here and got your hands dirty. And, 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 and your it's been years. Oh, yeah. 
Oh yeah, eight. Well, Brian just came in. He's like, Craig, we gotta go now! Sorry, well, I told them to oh, say that. Boy. Everything's falling apart, Steve. Oh, no. Oh, there he is. Brian specifically came in and said, Craig, there's no time to grab an apron. You gotta go now! Oh, yeah, yeah. I think it's actually my first time ever pouring it. <gasps> yeah, I think so. I think you got it. Hopefully. Alright, where'd I put my gloves on? Over there by the scale. Steve, this could be a disaster. <laughs> you got two right Should hands. Just like scoop it up. Pour it on the table. Okay, <laughs> okay come on. Oh, we got two. We got two righties over here. Uh oh. Uh oh. How's this gonna work out? All right, Craig, first part's done. I right, just stand there. Yeah, just uh, keep doing it like that, Dad. That's good. Thanks. Yeah, I can tell you've been practicing. Wow. I try hard to do it right. <laughs> that shows. Punch the camera again. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least he said excuse me this time. He usually doesn't give me a forewarning. Excuse me. Okay. Who's gonna lift that heavy kettle for your father? I would have done it. <laughs> But well, people but aren't going to blame you for not but picking it up. But missing out on all those noises? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Okay, so I'm going to add the... Uh, just being dramatic. So this is going to be two-tone. Which means 50-50. I think I still see the raspberry flavoring on top. Yeah. Hmm. We'll get it mixed in. Will we? Want some candy? Maybe not. No. This is, well, this is going to flavor half of the batch instead of just yeah. a stripe. Any color? Yeah, what you said. <laughs> this is purple flavored. It's purple flavored candy. How am I doing it keeping it off the camera lens? Mm, let's find out. <laughs> <laughs> so far so good. Mm -hmm. So we're doing this new thing. We're doing two tone. Instead of a stripe, we're doing, just doing half and half. Basically two big stripes and we're marrying them together. Yeah. You know why? Why? Because we can. Nobody said we couldn't, and if they did, we're not listening. That's the nice part of doing a small business. You can just do whatever you want. That's right. Whenever you want. Whenever you want, as long as you do it at least 12 hours a day. <laughs> yeah. Listen to the sound that I... Listen to the sound. I don't know. I might be tricking you. Like yesterday? Yeah. I, uh, I can't make it scream now. I was making it scream. Wait, try it again. Ah, oh no! Oh, see, Actually, there you go. It, it, yeah. And then I was doing this other thing, and she told me to quit playing with my food. Oh, okay. Can you make it now? <laughs> Probably not. I can throw my voice. <laughs> He never did that before. He was just like stares at me. But he understands me. Wow. We were doing Delgada yesterday. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Did you guys use the. Um, no, we were just drawing shapes in the Oh, okay. <laughs> no, I just. Your dad drew an umbrella. And I drew a triangle because it's the easiest one. Yeah. Yeah. Or a circle. Hmm. It's a circle that's one of the shapes, too, right? Mm -hmm. A circle, a triangle, square. Or, no, umbrella. circle, triangle. Star and umbrella, but they didn't. But they didn't know what it meant. You just had to pick a door with a symbol on it, yeah. and then. And if you pick the umbrella, bye. I'm just guessing. Not well, guess it. what? The main character picked the umbrella. Spoiler uh alert. -huh. And how did it work out, or don't we know? He's still the main character. But he did it. He did it. But he got it. He got the shape out in an untraditional way. He used his mind, his cleverness. Okay, I'm still probably not gonna watch it. Seems like a commitment. Okay, well he ends up just licking the actual thing. He licks it because the the little etches in the shape uh -huh. are thinner, so 
By the time he licks and licks and licks, uh -huh. those parts will be thin enough where he can just... Snap it? Yeah. And plus, you know, sometimes you need a little burst of sugar. Yeah. A little motivation, you know. <laughs> there was enough motivation for him to get that shit right. out. Is that? It looks like it's ready. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Good He's took it from me. <laughs> Good thing you tested it. Yeah. He's the best tester ever. I think so. Yep. Oh, it looks like it might be cold. Yeah, it is a little. It's okay. Yeah, I got a trained eye for this, you know. Yeah. You do. I've seen it once or twice. Yeah. A few times. In my day. Yeah. In my day. Back in my day, we pulled ribbon candy, we pulled ribbon candy on two hooks. <laughs> and we were bare grateful. Bare hands. Bare hands. Oh, bare hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and we and we didn't have a hammer to break the candy up. Use our fists. You had to do it right, or it wouldn't come off the hook. Correctly. Mm -hmm. Craig's like, I don't know what to do with my hands. There's a lot of people in here. So yeah, there are. How many candy makers does it take to make candy canes? You know. Enough. Uh, back in the day, you guys used to sometimes just do you and Dad. Yeah. Well, we would need somebody to wrap them. Yeah, okay. This is good. Okay. Hold it. I got it. Oh, look at that. Oh, fake. What a <laughs> Go ahead, Craig. Push it together. Okay. You know, just knead it like bread. You what know do I, I do, Dylan? Bread. Knead it like bread. <laughs> knead it like bread. <laughs> oh, you made that. bread. You're yeah. a bread master. I do make my own bread. If you'd like to buy Craig's bread, just <laughs> go to... Oh, wait. Yeah. yeah. Good luck. Point. Do a quarter turn and then you push it. That's what I do for bread anyway. That's Spread it out. Pretty much okay. Drink, drink, drink. Mm. It just gets lower every time. <laughs> yep. Because like you guys were actually we're actually watching that movie right now. Yep. What movie's on? Uh, Christmas Vacation. Yeah, the doorbell keeps going down. Lower. <laughs> Did you get something to drink? Get something to drink, please. Are we just squishing these together? Um, we're gonna make it into a triangular shape. Okay. Oh wait, are we, are we doing that? I thought you said it was two tone, right? It's two tone, but I think that's what we're doing. But I don't want to mess it up on your dad. We'll let him do it. I just want to get a drink. Okay. He's a drink his water. Yeah, stay hydrated. Very important. Steve, you feel better now? Wow. I'm drinking your water, dude. There you go, Steve. Oh, there you go, Steve. Drinking your water again. Whenever I see him drink the the water bottle in here, I think of uh, Space Jam when they have the what is it? The special oh, yeah. the special juice or whatever, and they're yeah. like, Shh. all of a sudden he's gonna drink it, and gain fifty pounds of muscle, and hmm. couldn't fit any more muscle on him. Nope. Yeah, <laughs> just too much already. Just bursting through his skin. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I should probably switch to other gloves, huh? I'm wearing the appropriate apron. Oh, my apron is totally appropriate for this. It is? Mine is baby cake, so it's perfect for this occasion. Oh. Wow. I nice. totally planned that. Did mm -hmm. you? Yeah. I'll teach Craig how to do some candy canes. Oh, wait, he knows how to do candy canes, right? Well, it's been a while since I taught him, I think. I grew up making candy canes. I was born in it. Yeah. Molded by it. <laughs> yeah. That was like the thing that I did the most. Which was only like once a year. <laughs> no one cared who I was until I made the hook on the candy cane. <laughs> Okay. I'm like, what do you want me to do with that? Yeah, that's... <laughs> oh, nice. Nice attempt, Dad. We'll cut up samples. <laughs> the oh. last second. There we go. Dad, what if the candy cutter broke and you had to do that for a hard candy day? Oh, that'd be awful. <laughs> <laughs> Forearm day. 
That reminds me of uh, Dwight in the office when he talks about he goes, Ooh. you want a forearm workout? I'll have you cut. Oh, yeah. I'll have you cut in ten. What is that for five cents a yard? That's a big old sample. Huh? Oh yeah, I didn't see. I make one big candy cane out of it. All right, go for it. The biggest candy cane ever known. This is hot. Okay. <laughs> it's pretty hot right now. Gotta keep twisting it though. Wow, it's going to be so nice. <laughs> <laughs> candy cane, only a, wow. a oh. candy maker could love. Yeah, I love Steve's way. gotten to the part of the point where he's like, I'm just going to push Dylan out of the okay. way. <laughs> I can't get my arm in there. Right? Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, it's tough when you're shooting the videos because you got to look through the viewfinder to see what's there, but then you also have to pay attention to like real life to make sure you're not getting away. And it's, just it's whole do thing. like the oh. uh, lollipop. Oh, yeah, lollipop, yeah. yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> Very convenient. All right, Craig, you got a candy cane coming out. I got a lollipop I'm working on right now. Wow. 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 I need a stick. Right there. Oh, okay. No. Oh, save these marks No, here. he needs that. Let me grab another one. <laughs> he's, a, he's infatuated by the lollipop. <laughs> Then rubber room. Oh See, Steve, this is why we don't let him do anything with the candy. Does he want to stick the stick in the candy himself? Yeah. Quick, Craig. All right. You only have 10 seconds left. I know. Perform surgery. Stab it through. Oh. There we go. You know what? One. Wow. That's gonna be a heavy lollipop. <laughs> <laughs> Five pounds. Five bucks. Okay. <laughs> I'm doing it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. All right. So what's the little... okay? All right. So you take it the top part, not not the bottom part. I have one thumb down here, and then they meet to form that perfect half circle. And then you want a straight bottom of the cane. And you don't want any points sticking up. So break the plastic. So that's pretty close. You just want a little more. Sure. Yeah, that the bottom half's good. You want it straight like that. Sure. But you also don't want the hook too far apart. So yeah, that's good. You don't want too far out here, too close in. You want to make sure that the plastic can fit, or the tubes can fit around it. Yeah, that's my best one so far. Whoa. The only thing I'd say is make sure that the tip is more down, like at the bottom, like flat. A couple candy canes in this day. That's a few. It's tough, like sending them over and not warping them too much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Karen, how many candy canes do you think you've made in your life? Um, let's see, 20 times like 2400. That's it. 240,000, no, 480,000. Something like that. At least. Yeah. So, let's just round up to about a half a million. Yeah, sure. <laughs> well, I'm saying 500,000. Yeah. Well, I thought you said 240, though. Let's no, no. No, because you said 20. I thought I was oh, thinking 10 okay. in my head. Okay. So. Well, yeah, half a mil. Mm. There's a title right there. Mm. Kara makes her 500,000th can. <laughs> yeah, this one right here. Kara, this is the one right here. The one that Craig's doing? Yeah, yeah that's your 500,000th can, Kara. Yeah. Here we go. This is it. 500,000. Look at all the confetti everywhere. Oh, Ooh, and yay. All right, well, now we're moving on. Right. Nothing special now, Kara. Come on. That's what we call her. Nothing special. Nothing special, Kara. Yeah. Okay, nothing to offer. Hmm. Craig, did you think when you came in today you'd be working on some candy canes? <laughs> it's always something different here. Swinging canes. Well, what a marketing. 
We're always it's doing always something, something different We're here. We're always together. We're always doing something fun. Wow. <laughs> Candy cane kebab. Candy cane there. You okay? Candy cane pate. Oh. Candy cane sandwiches. <laughs> We're broken. Mm -hmm. Candy cane candies. You got your candy canes, candy cane pop, candy cane uh, uh, candy bites, cane. candy cane forest. And yeah, other places uh, around the world, you go in the woods and find these. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is kind of off topic, but it got me thinking because uh, okay. we're always mentioning SpongeBob. Mm -hmm. You know, they just came out with uh, eels, eels and ladders hmm. really? from SpongeBob. After all these years, it's finally yeah. a board game now. Oh. About time. I know. Oh, is that what you want for Christmas? Yeah. Honestly, I might go get it. Oh. Not even Wait, is it eels and ladders or is it escalators? Eels and escalators. Yeah, because I just remember him yelling, hmm. escalator, 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 escalator. <laughs> Eels. And then he does the little dolphin noise. Huh. Uh, they only have uh, seasons one through three on Amazon Prime, so I found that out the hard way when I was like, what? Oh, Where's the other episodes? <laughs> Maybe they're on YouTube. Yeah, it says that they're on the Paramount streaming app, whatever yeah. that is. Okay, there we go. I yeah. have that. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Season four, here I come. Yeah, me and Deb watch stuff on Paramount Plus all the time. Yeah. Paramount Plus. Awesome. Yeah, but you watch SpongeBob on Paramount Plus, right? No. And that's the only thing you watch. NCIS. Isn't that the only reason you got it? Yeah. <laughs> it's for NCIS. Well, I can't. I don't have cable. What? <laughs> it's not on but, Netflix. Well, it's only five bucks. I know, but that's the thing. That's how they get you, because you're like, oh, it's only five bucks, but then like, you have three other shows you like, and they're all on three different streaming devices or services. Yeah, I'm on the current season. I'm sure so there's I'm a lot of... Episodes come out, so I'm sure there's a lot of can't people watch who got Peacock just for The Office. Yeah. Or you could have been like us. There's like four of us that have the box set. Yeah, I have both box sets, yeah, the U.S. and I U.K. version. box set for emergencies, you know? <laughs> Emergency use only. Do you just have the box behind a, a pane of glass? <laughs> yeah. Break in case of Bulletproof. Well, well, then how are you going to get to it? <laughs> just don't shoot it. Oh. oh, I have the key. It's not axe-proof. Oh. I have the key to it. Okay, well that makes sense now. Okay. Not axe-proof, just bulletproof. And for sports fans, you can watch football on Sunday. Nah. Well, that's nah, what I man. do sometimes when my antenna doesn't come in well. Hmm. Oh yeah, Dad had uh, a system rigged up at a... Uh, at the house that I bought, my my house now, there's an antenna on top, and you had like a remote to move it or something. Yeah. Then he had a mirror. Uh, oh my goodness! Uh, uh, just on, hanging up next to the the shed, so then he could see which way he was pointing it. Yep. You were you were living in 2066. For the rest of us, 1999. The futuristic man. Modern problems require modern solutions. It becomes the football. He's yeah. like, you know what? It's because of football. Yeah. Wait, if it wasn't game football, game? he wouldn't have thought of it. No. <laughs> you get special powers when you gotta figure <laughs> things out like that. Yeah, jokes, yeah, problem solving skills, come to the territory. Mm -hmm. If that's the TV, yeah, we'll figure it out. <laughs> and football. <laughs> you know, you gotta have uh, some superpowers, you know. <laughs> we need to get somebody holding a camera, pointing a camera at Hat. Dylan shooting these videos too. No. So you can see like my dad going like this <laughs> to cut it around the camera. Don't tell him our secrets. <laughs> uh, Max would have to do that too. He'd just like whenever I was doing anything, like especially ribbon candy, he'd be like making ribbon candy like this so that I could get yep. the camera under his arm. So uh, I grab the bag and I put the concealer down. I pick it up and it's sealed. How about that? Oh. How about that? Oh. Yep, that's what she's doing. We're going through all this stuff here. Sometimes the jobs are a little mundane here at Hercules, but they got to get done. A little dangerous. Oh, yeah, oh look. See? Oh. We got a breakthrough. Oh my goodness. We've got an escapee. I know, they are sharp on the edges sometimes. Like, look at that. If you're not careful, slice you up. Like a pizza. How's the packaging going? Boring. 
It's okay. Right? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. It's not the worst. I mean, I guess it's good to switch it up every once in a while because it can get really tiring pulling candy and like throwing it and stuff. But it's fun though. I know. Yeah, you. Oh uh, yeah, you like that. You like all the physical activity. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Ryan, you like cardio, right? I love it. Cardio? He loves yeah, cardio. Hey, he does BJJ. That's a lot of cardio, actually. No, but like, what was that yesterday? You were like, that sounds like cardio. You were like, oh god, I want to do that. It was like walking from here to the sink or something. All right, Steve, we're at the end of the line. This is the end of the line for you, kid. But not the end of the day. You no. Still, still got a few more batches. Unfortunately. Three more Bye. batches. Okay. Three more, we're making five batches today. That's not so bad. Only ten more to go. <laughs> <laughs> That's not how math works. <laughs> we just count, we just count five, yeah, just more. like his dad used to do. Just one more batch, Steve. Yeah. Just one more. It'll be alright. Surprise! <laughs> I didn't think you could count, so I figured you could count. <laughs> yeah, you didn't know I could count. You didn't notice. We're gonna be here till midnight. Nope. I was passing the buck off to her. Uh, no, that's a candy cane. Oh. That's the oh, okay. I'll tr I'll try it then. Nice. Thanks, Dad. I mean, Dylan. What? What? Son? There's something I have to tell you. <laughs> oh, these years. I am a whole ten days older than you, so I can see where you get that mixed up. I think twelve days. I don't know. Kara said ten earlier. Well, I not ten. Ten would be twenty-nine. So. Thirty-one minus nineteen. Oh, yeah. Good job. Yeah, twenty-one. 21? What? 21. Yeah, 21 yeah. days. Right? Sure. Right. It's totally right. right. Absolutely. Dylan knows man. Alternative math. Alternative math? Alternative math. Yeah, it's my truth. If I believe that that's the number, <laughs> then that's it. Right? That's how math works. You gotta speak your truth, Dylan. Yeah. <laughs> And I say that two 29. Two. 2 plus 2 is 10. Everyone knows that. Yes. We changed it. Who's we? Oh, God, I feel stupid. 2 plus 2 is how we got all the purple in this candy cane. Wow. <laughs> Aren't you a proud dad? Listen to all those smart math equations. Yeah, wow, that's good. I got 42. Math? Math. Steve's really good at math. Mm. Right, Steve? Right. I mean, you have to get a calculus degree to become a candy maker. Yeah. Some guy in the class, Yeah, that's true. So to use the thumbs, okay. like Tara teached me. Wow, that's a great candy cane. I think you might make it in this business. <laughs> really mean it? Nope. Sorry. I shouldn't have asked. Just kidding. <laughs> I know the answer. Oh. The answer. Oh, <laughs> Your thumb. Oh no. You all right? My thumb. Uh, oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh, it doesn't even bleed. <laughs> all right, I knew I was cold. I knew you were made of sugar. <laughs> I'm long hair, don't care Craig, and welcome to my parents' candy shop. Do you like candy canes? Well, we got them. Do you like deals? We got those too. Just off the top of my head, we've got some watermelon root beer, orange, wintergreen, peppermint, raspberry, green apple, and we used to have blue raspberry. But maybe by the time this video is up, if we can get the L's working, we'll have some of those too. And for a limited time, we're giving away free candy as long as you give us free money. And that's a no hair, long hair, don't care, Craig, guarantee. I guarantee it.